Hello everybody, thank you for joining us. Today we are going to do a quick sketch of Hank Scorpio from The Simpsons. And this character, for those who do not know, you should check out this episode. And it's essential, like, television viewing period like it's, it's not that it's just like great because it's a Simpsons uh, element there but it's just great television very funny and brilliant and always entertaining you can watch it a number of times and we will still enjoy watching it again so Hank Scorpio as far as I know appeared in one episode I'm not sure if it was more than one but one episode that I know of in which Homer cites uh, a new job so first first off like what we're doing is they had shoulders shot and there's the there's a that jacket collars and shoulders okay so Hank Scorpio is Homer's new employer in that particular episode and Homer moves from Springfield to another location I do not remember the location but uh, and he's based because Scorpio believes that Homer has had a vast experience work experience at the at the nuclear plant and it is apparently it is like misinterpreted that he's a very very experienced person and he can through his experience spearhead the projects that Scorpio is involved in and Homer takes the job and he and his family end up with this awesome uh, home like it's a dream home and where everything is like automated everything is technological because uh, Hank is the owner of a technological corporation and he is an evil genius so we're doing the uh, show showing the head from the side sort of and the brilliant says he acts very nice to like he's he's very nice to Homer because he respects Homer's work experience and that Homer is able to through very unconventional means motivate Hank's staff into working faster and more productively to meet the deadlines which Homer is entirely clueless about are to make a weapon so Hank is essentially a technological mogul and a terrorist and it's all uh, happening under Homer's nose Homer doesn't have a clue and he doesn't have a clue till the end in fact in a very funny uh, moment uh, Homer also helps capture Bond and James Bond well I guess they do not necessarily hint it's James Bond but it was definitely James Bond or a very Bond like character who infiltrates Hank Scorpio's base and Homer is the one who catches him and helps uh, thwart the attempt to scuttle Scorpio's project and then in the end even they are like sh showing that you know Scorpio has been successful and he begins like laying waste to power and uh, to key landmarks on the globe to you know begin cementing his evil cred so very funny episode and definitely a must watch 
so Hank Scorpio was uh, voiced by Albert Brooks who is involved on a continuous basis with the Simpsons but who is also a, a sort of a senior figure when it comes to writing production and direction duties for some awesome projects on American television and theater so I'm talking about for instance everybody must have heard of Finding Nemo and you must have uh, of course uh, Mr. Brooks is heavily involved in the Simpsons and he was also part of the uh, acting team on the very cultural favorite and gritty movie Drive. I think this was around in 2011. So we're going to speed up the video for a few seconds and uh, just going to fill in the hair and give the jacket a certain color and then we will just finish this off. And we're back. The coloring here in case of uh, Mr. Scorpio was very like subtle. So these colors like they uh, tend to have a lot of like straight lines here and there. So we thought I mean we would just like do a quick fill in and then you know just finish this off. So in the episode back to the episode in which uh, which was also named the favorite episode of that particular season. I'm not sure if it was the 6th or the 8th season, but uh, it was the favorite episode of that season. That's, that's how good it was. So Homer and his family eventually like they move back because they want the simpler life rather than this life. And it was a good thing because as I mentioned that Scorpio was an evil genius who blew up a let's say a uh, landmark bridge to prove his point that he would hold the world hostage and Homer helped him get there without a clue as to what he's doing or that he's evil and he rewards Homer in the end by gifting him a football team that Homer won no not the one that he wanted Homer always wanted to own the dollars the Dallas Cowboys but uh, since uh, 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 Scorpio, I guess due to he's not he's not been short to be short of money, since he was not able to procure the Cowboys, he gifted Homer the Denver Broncos, and Homer was disappointed. So another jab at football there, and uh, brilliantly done. In fact, like they showed the the Broncos playing in Homer's front yard. And uh, so that was Scorpio's idea of being, uh, giving to his loyal employee. So please do check it out. And again, as I said, it was voiced by brilliantly by uh, the guest, the guest personality, Albert Brooks. 
and brilliantly written and endlessly entertaining. So we put out content every day. So please keep in touch, subscribe. Thank you for watching and have yourself a wonderful day.